This is Daddy from Busy Daddy Cooks. A subscriber has asked for a kangkong recipe. So, here it is. Today, we are still frying kangkong with fermented bean curd. Kangkong goes by several names. Morning Glory, River Spinach, Water Spinach, Chinese Spinach, or in Chinese, Tong Sing Cai. There are as many names as there are ways to cook it. Today, I will show you one of my favourite ways of stir-frying this vegetable. And it only requires a few ingredients. But firstly, how do you choose kangkong? Look at the leaves. When it's fresh, the leaves are bright or dark green in colour. Avoid wilted or yellow colour leaves. Also, look for the leaves that are thin and smooth. The bottom of the stems should look hydrated and not dried out. Look for tender stems that gives a little crunch when you pinch them. They should also be soft and easy to bend. That's how you know they are tender and not fibrous. To prepare the kangkong, wash them. Then, cut off the roots. Cut about 3-4 to four inches from the bottom. The other ingredients that we need are fermented bean curd. Now, there are many types of fermented bean curd, but you can use any type that you fancy. Oyster sauce, garlic, and sugar. To stir fry, put your pan over a medium heat. When the pan is hot, add in the oil. And when the oil is hot, add in the fermented bean curd. Try to break the fermented bean curd up a little. Then, oyster sauce. Sugar, garlic. Add in water. Continue to break up the fermented bean curd. But there's no need to break the fermented bean curd up too finely. Next, add in the vegetables. Use the folding method to fold the vegetables while you stir fry. Continue to fold the vegetables over itself until all the vegetables are wilted. When do you stop cooking the vegetables? Well, this will depend on how crunchy or mushy you want the stems to be. When the texture is what you like it to be, turn off the heat. Taste and adjust with seasoning. Mine needs a little soy sauce.
This is Stir Fry Kangkong with fermented bean curd. <laughs>